people have been vying to create the smartphone successor for quite some time, and two companies in particular have recently launched their solutions. The Rabbit R1 is a pocket-sized device with its own LAN that was introduced at CES 2024 and sold out of its first and second batches in a matter of days. But how does it compare to the wearable Humane AI pin, which debuted in November 2023? One of the most noticeable differences between the Rabbit R1 and the Humane AI pin is how they are intended to be held or worn. As the name implies, the Humane AI pin is a device that can be pinned to your chest. To control the pin, you can use the touchpad on your chest, the handheld laser ink display, or voice commands. The Rabbit R1 resembles a modern foldable flip phone, like the Samsung Galaxy Z Flip 5 or Motorola Razr 40 Ultra. However, unlike these phones, the pocket-sized device does not fold out to reveal a larger display. Rather, the Rabbit R1 is meant to be controlled with an analog scroll wheel, a push-to-talk button, and your voice. Unlike the Humane AI pin, the Rabbit R1 fits in your pocket, making it less of a fashion statement and more discreet to carry. The LAM or large action model that powers Rabbit OS, the operating system of the Rabbit R1, powers the device. Through the LAM, Rabbit OS is able to learn how you use apps and services, which enables it to perform tasks like flight booking, Photoshop image editing, and music and movie streaming on your behalf. Applications for food, ride-sharing, maps, shopping, travel, music, generative AI, and other topics are supported. To transfer control, simply sign into each app once via the Rabbit Hole web portal. Then, use your voice to instruct the Rabbit R1 to finish a task. Through the Rabbit Hole, you can view your previous interactions with the Rabbit R1 and manage your preferences and personal data. The way the Rabbit R1 and the Humane AI pin operate is slightly different. With the Human AI pin, you can accomplish tasks with your voice or a laser ink display that is projected onto the palm of your hand, saving you from giving complete control to a lamb. You can touch, tap, and swipe on the device's touchpad on your chest to answer calls, adjust the volume, take pictures, and more. You can also tilt and roll your hand to interact with the display and close your fingers to make a selection. In certain situations, the AI pin may assume control. One way to reduce the number of notifications you receive is to limit who can call and message you. Catch me up is an intriguing feature on the Humane AI pin. Say this to get the AI pin to go through your calls and texts and provide you with a quick rundown of everything you missed. With just a simple voice command, the AI pin can also create messages that sound just like you and translate between languages in real time. The cost of the Human AI pin is $699, whereas the Rabbit R1 is $199. Naturally, both of them are less expensive than a lot of high-end smartphones. These devices will likely cost extra money on top of the phone you already have, if you're not ready to give it up just yet. What do you think about these devices, which model is better and is it worth paying more, write your opinion in the comments, have a nice day and God bless you.